Hello, Gary Simon here of designcourse.com. Today is February 15th and I wanted to put out a video here that's a little bit different uh, than just regular design work. This is something that a lot of creative freelancers face and that is procrastination. Uh, so basically I, got, I gained this idea, I first stumbled on this idea from Stefan Molyneux of Free Domain Radio and he put out a video uh, about the roots of procrastination and it's something that resonated with me so much that I really wanted to kind of just reiterate it a little bit and kind of gear it towards my audience. So basically, where does procrastination come from? All right, so two systems usually. Uh, parenting, you know, basically how you were raised, and also school. So most of us, unfortunately, had to undergo the public education system for 12 years. And there are two parallels when it comes to parenting and education. So, basically, when it comes to parenting, you have the parent up here and you have the child down here. It's a hierarchy, of, in a sense, that we create uh, as a society. And we believe that whatever the parent says, the child must do. And that's kind of how it is largely throughout the world. And in the same way, when it comes to public education, you have the teachers and the faculty up here, and then down here you have the students. And the students are to obey them and listen to what they say because they're the teachers and that's, the, you know, that's it. So when it comes to all the busy homework, well, you just got to do it, right? <laughs> and I can tell you with certainty, I'm 30 now, and it's been 12 years since I've uh, graduated high school. You, 97, 98% of everything that you were forced to learn or, or memorize and then forget, you either just forget it and you don't use it. All right? So much in the same way when it comes to parenting, uh, and I have two daughters, and I'm trying my best not to do this. When it comes to parenting, well, it's a belief that there, there must be blind obedience and you must do what your parents say. And that's that, just for that alone. It's ridiculous, really, if you think about it. So what happens is from very early childhood, from day one practically, and all the way through, you know, when you're arbitrarily considered to be an adult and a free person, you're conditioned to do things that you aren't internally motivated to do. And so much in the same way when it comes to slavery, you have the master up here and you have the slave down here. He performs the work, but it's not very good and it's against his will. And so there are so many different parallels between those three things in societies. And what happens throughout those 18 years is you develop, unfortunately, a reaction, a negative reaction every time that you are to do something. And what's really unfortunate about it is even if that something is going to be productive or good for you in your life, you have this immediate inherent sort of pushback, struggle. that You don't want to do it. And that's really what procrastination is, and that's really how it starts. And it's formulated. It's not something you're born with. When it comes to nature versus nurture, it's definitely your environment. It's the nurture. And that's a good thing because if you were, if we were all just born procrastinators or certain people were just born being a procrastinator, you can't change it. So here's the thing. You can change it. And the way that I kind of helped, or not help rather, but I kind of overcome my problem of procrastination was simply watching that video and then just letting it resonate. Because once you understand that it's not a permanent fixture in your life, that's when you will become naturally, internally motivated to do things that you know will be good for you. So when it comes to designers or freelancers, you know that it's going to be good for you to learn new things. So watching these videos, that's great. You're going to learn something new. You're going to need to better your position in life. Uh, when it comes to creating, by uh, obviously putting out work, bettering your skills, bettering your business, trying maybe trying to learn marketing if you're a freelancer. Uh, these are all things that, you know, people, they know will be good for them, but they'll, they'll just put it off. And that's unfortunate. And that's an issue of procrastination. And it, res it results from years upon years of kind of being told what to do, not wanting to do it. And that's unfortunate. So uh, if you're in the boat of procrastination, uh, don't worry. It's not permanent. Let this resonate with you. Watch Stefan Molyneux's video. He'll go into a little bit more details and depth about procrastination. And if you really let it sink in, you will definitely overcome it. 
All right, so I'm Gary Simon, designcourse.com. Subscribe here on YouTube, and we'll get back to the design stuff tomorrow.